Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. Derek reacts back at it again. And yes, we're going to be doing Britney Spears. It's been a while since I've done Britney Spears. And I'm looking forward to it. Taking it back to 2009 with If You Seek Amy. Uh, and I'm looking forward to this. The official video recommendation made by you guys. And it made it through. Um, I also have a live stream coming. 40K has arrived. Saturday, October 3rd, 4 p.m. Pacific time. Looking forward to meet you all guys there and answer your questions and get to chat and all that stuff. I'm looking forward to it. But before we get into the video, please take a moment, comment, like, and subscribe. I would love to hear your feedback. Makes videos like these all the possible. And also take a moment to follow me and like me both on Instagram and on Facebook. And if you're new to the channel, guys, welcome. I also have a Patreon link down below. Be sure to check that out when you get a chance. Help support my channel. It makes recommendations like the one you're about to watch all the more possible. All right, guys, without further ado, let's go. You seek Amy. Oh. <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, baby, baby, have you seen Amy tonight? Oh. Is she in the bathroom? Is she smoking up outside? Oh, baby, baby, does she take a piece of lime for the drink that I'ma buy? Or do you know just what she likes? Oh, 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 tell me, have you seen her? Cause I'm so, oh, I can get her off of my brain. I just wanna go to the party, she gon' go. Can somebody take me home? Ha, ha, he, he, ha, ha, ha. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's stop it here, guys. Let's stop it here. A lot of stuff going on. <laughs> a lot of stuff going on. Let's talk about the sounds for a minute. I'm hearing some drums in the back there. Almost kind of like those big drums coming in. I don't know if you guys caught them. Very, very dancey. Very, uh, you know, very, very interesting on percussions and keyboard arrangements already coming in. And then you see her where she's, she was at. She was in, in this kind of like almost house party type of thing. And she's woken up. She's woken up, and um, they look like they were all having sex, guys. They look like they had a wild night. Wild night. These bare, barely clothed men and, and, and women all over the place. I think the wife saw lingerie and stuff like that. And then you notice, too, in the beginning with the, the news anchor, uh, how she emphasizes the words, F -U, if you seek Amy, um, which spells out, if you, if, you, if you carefully do it, um, spell it out, F you seek Amy, you know? You know what I mean, guys. I'll, I'll go into it a little bit deeper later, but you know what I mean. Love it, love it, love it on instrumentation, guys. So far, so good. Love it. Yeah, the drums. She's gonna meet me up. I don't know where or when or now they're closing up the club. I've seen her once or twice before she knows my face, but it's hard to see with all the people standing in the way. Oh, 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 tell me, have you seen her? Cause I'm so, oh, I can get her off of my brain. I just wanna go to the party, she gon' go. Can somebody take me home? Ha, ha, he, he, ha, ha, ha. Love it. Love it. The instrumentation is completely killing it with the song. Oh my god, I'm loving it. The key the keyboards, the snares, all those things. Um almost almost like you hear some brass instruments there. Some bra a lot of brass instruments. Uh with uh, some nice drums and and then the guitars coming in nicely and everything like that. Keyboard arrangements. All oh, instrumentation winning this one for me. Very, very good production on this one. And, of course, Britney Spears moving in her vocals, you know, doing her thing here. I'm getting some Eyes Wide Shut vibes with the with this power party thing going on here. Uh, I've mentioned this before in other videos. I think it was the, the one with Laura Brennigan. Um, I can't remember which what video that was, but if you go, go back to the, 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 that my 80s playlist, you'll see it there with Laura Brennigan. This has kind of like those kind of like similar, similar vibes, but this one's a little bit quicker in pace in terms of, you know, camera movements and stuff like that. I like this. This is pretty cool. Um, very, very interesting. Very interesting. I wonder why 
rewind it here for a second. I want to show you guys something that you, I don't know if you guys noticed. Notice in the back there, there's a whole bunch of guys watching the girls, kind of like almost like a perform, like a performance thing, almost like what, what you saw in, um, in Eyes Wide Shot. I keep referencing it, but that's how it is. The guys are just like standing around and then looking at the woman perform. Look at, look at this. I'm going to rewind so you guys can see what I see. Very, very interesting, kind of sexual, sexual connotations, sexual connotations, and they're performing here. Almost like it's a poor performance. Oh. So catchy. Notice how they follow her. Love it, love, love it. Love this instrumentation, guys, and how it explodes. Notice the transition there, what they did too. Um, with those sounds. This sounds so 2000-ish. Oh my gosh, so 2000s, late 2000s, 2000, 2009. Uh, it has all those sounds. I love it. Uh, I like it. I like how they did that and how they're doing it. Very suggestive in terms of the lyrical content and what they're trying to get there. Um, F-U-C-K me, you know, um, and everything like that. And, you know, <laughs> what she's saying and when she's going down the stairs, the, the guys are kind of like following her and stuff like that. Love it how this is dressed up in a very, very dance, poppy song. Of course, it's Britney. That's what she's going to do. But also very controversial as well. We'll get, that to, get to it a little bit later. But slaying it with sound. Slaying it with sound. Interesting. Doesn't make any sense, does it? Oh, <laughs> I didn't. I don't know what she, what it said there in the end. Uh, the the news anchor, what she said there in the end. Um, she said something. It doesn't make any sense, does it? And then it says, "I spell, spell, spell out obscenity in disguise." In the end, Fox News, I think. Fox News, by the way. Notice how she is too dressed up. Um, towards the end, more conservative looking. She's conservative looking. She has the, you know, that white picket fence, the whole, the whole shebang of, you know, of, of a, of the, of a white conservative, you know, family, I guess. Um, and, and she, and she has that. She has that whole appeal, you know, the dress up and everything like that. Very interesting. So, um, guys, sound on this is good. Sound on good is good because it has a very, very great arrangement in terms of drums, percussions, and those those brass instruments with that nice bass and the guitars and the timpani, which is part of the percussion um, family there. Very, very dancey, very dancey. So I want to talk to you about some controversy, controversy that this uh, song has. Um, Australian music site Undercover.com on December 5th, 2008, said that after the release of the album, Len 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 Lenny Barson Barsenbach a housewife from Sydney said, I was astonished and totally taken back when I heard my five and seven year old kids walking around the house singing F U C K. When I asked them what it was, they told me it was Britney Spears. I was horrified. I got them the circus album, but there was no warning on it. You know how it usually has like label, whatever, parental advisor. It is extremely offensive, and I feel deceived. God, the FCC must have had a field day with this with this song. I mean, 
uh, on the radio and all that stuff because I'm, I think they had toned it. I think they had changed it. They changed it to if you if you um, instead of if you seek Amy, I think they said if you see. How do they change it? They changed they changed it in some way to make it much more radio friendly or whatever. Uh, if you see Amy, if you see Amy, not seek, if you see Amy, they changed that. So um, yeah, so it it it's it it's basically Spears looking for a woman named Amy in a club, although it appears to be more about sex. It's actually about how society perceives her life, kind of like maybe the lens in the outside world, um, and that's kind of like seen and how she's you know doing it like that. They say that supposedly Mel and Kelly, uh, Megan Kelly made an appearance. I didn't see her. I don't know if that was the, the woman in the beginning and then the end. I'm not sure. It didn't look like her, but they said that Megan Kelly made an appearance. Um, so she's looking for Amy in a white cl in, 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 uh, Amy in, uh, in, a, in a club. But some people also have suggested that maybe she's talking about Amy Winehouse. Um, you know, an alter ego of Spears herself. That is interesting. That is very interesting. Here, here are the lyrics. Love me, hate me. Say what you want about me. A reference to the public's perception and Spanish fascination of Spears' life. It's always been like that. It's always been like that. She's always been on uh, tabloids and all that stuff. Um, oh my God, you know, she's she's doing this, she's doing that. You know, her her lifestyle, she's she's a wackadoodle or whatever like that. They, they say a whole bunch of stuff. Um, it's all over, it's plastered all over the, the media, especially during that time. Uh, the present Spears both uh, have is an object of desire and a punching bag. Notice, notice that. So all of the boys are, all the girls are begging to, if you seek Amy. Very interesting, guys. Very interesting. Video was very great. Very video was very great. It was, you you see the 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 newsroom there in the the beginning, kind of like um the exploitation, you know, that Britney Spears is trying to discuss, and then she's kind of like awoken in the middle of kind of like a very very rough night or whatever from a wild party that had to do with sex and everything like that. Um, very, very interesting. Getting, getting, uh, those eyes wide shut vibes. Very, very good movie, guys, if you haven't seen it. Um, but how did this do on the charts, guys? Well, in Brazil, Hot 100, 1. U.S. Mainstream Top 40 Billboard, 8. And the U.S. Billboard Hot 100, 19. Not too bad, not too bad, guys. Not too bad. So it was, it was pretty good. And it, very catchy, very catchy. I can see how this would be a very catchy type of, you know, type of radio song at the time, but... Great recommendation, guys. Great recommendation. Um, I'll see you guys for the next Britney Spears reaction. Send them my way. Looking forward to it. Until next time, guys. Take care. Hey, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you'd like to see more videos like these, be sure to check this one out. And also, take a moment to comment, like, and smash the subscribe button to stay on all the latest reaction videos. And guys, yes, I have a Patreon link down below. Be sure to check that out. Help support the channel. Makes your voice, your recommendations, all the more possible. Take care, guys. Love you guys. Peace.